welcome to another video walk on the wild side and i am here in a black pool just outside the old odian cinema this is where the rugby ground used to be right here in a blackpool borough park rugby ground who remembers it they also had a dog track going around here as well yeah check it out anyway it's all changed around here you know hey the sun's out look at that there look at, ooh. it's not that warm though and just behind me is the all new well i say all new it was complete flash here club 3000 bingo let's check it out shall we So there you go, here's a look at the Odeon. Or what was the Odeon? What are they going to do with it? I'm not too sure. There's been a few plans to turn it into different units, even like a storage place as well. Yeah, I think that's where the grandstand was for the rugby ground, yeah. So all this space here is where the rugby ground and greyhound track was. But now look at it, it's transformed, isn't it? And we've got this Club 3000 bingo here, which is really, really popular. And uh, just over this way, I just want to show you that it's changing all the time around here. Now there used to be, well in fact, there used to be a pub here called the Swift Hound. Yeah, the Swift Hound, it stood somewhere around there and used to drive in there. But that's gone that that went years ago and we've also got if you look over here we've got a frankie and benny's that was a frankie and benny's but it's not anymore and as we look over this way we've got an all new starbucks check it out so i thought i'd have a little mooch around here i want to go to the promenade because i want to see how busy it is it's a sunday afternoon and uh, it's actually getting on a bit now it's uh it's about four o'clock in the afternoon i think Probably a lot of people will probably be leaving now, but I was watching a video the other day by It's Not Your Boy Leroy, and uh, and he filmed around the front on, I think it was a Saturday, and my goodness, it was so quiet in Blackpool, I could not believe it, so I thought I'd take a little look today, and uh, we'll see what it's like, although it is getting on a bit now. It does seem fairly quiet in here, to be quite honest. It seems pretty dead in here. We've got Bannertines over there, the health club and spa. That used to be where there was a gasometer over there, yeah? But they've got that uh, big aerial over there. If you look at old pictures, you'll see the gasometer, yeah? Anyway, uh, let's check out this Starbucks, shall we? Yeah, so that's looking towards Bannertines, and then, of course, just across from Bannertines, uh, you've got your McDonald's. They go here. Uh, together quite well don't they anyway check it out look starbucks we've got a starbucks a new starbucks a drive through starbucks doesn't it look fancy so this is going to be where you get your your coffee let's have a little look from here can you see anything in there i can't see anything it's pretty fancy though isn't it what do you reckon and it's changing around here all the time they had to build a new road coming into here look someone shouted out over there <laughs> this this road here is a different road to the one they used to have coming in i just want to give you a little bit of a tip now this car park here i park in quite a lot and i don't pay anything yeah because at the moment there's no cameras there's no there's no restrictions that i can see don't hold me to that but i can't see any restrictions on parking in here all day i've parked in here a few times yeah i've never paid so there you go little tip for you check out this slate gravel we've got here just outside the starbucks i think i might come along with a few bags and uh, Look quite nice in my garden, that what do you reckon? Yeah? Hey. Anyway, I want to head towards the promenade and uh, just look at that. Blazing in the sky there. So let's go and see how busy it is on the promenade, shall we? Let's see if it's a little bit more busy today than it was on uh, 
Pete's video, I'll put a link to his video in the description. Do you want to see it? Just over there we've got the the new Foxhall village. This is where all the it was all industrial over here. We used to have the Mecca down that way there, the Mecca, dancing, Northern Soul. Over here used to be a lot of uh, a lot of works. The, the illuminations department was based just over here. But it's all new houses now, as you can see. Foxhall, the Foxhall village. There you go. There's a little look the other way towards the McDonald's. There, hello. There you go. Yeah, so uh, there you go. Going to head down this way now, straight towards Manchester Square, and uh, we'll see what it's like. So, do you fancy one of these houses here? in the Foxhall village. What do you reckon? A lot of people don't like these. They reckon they're... Uh, I've heard a lot of people on Facebook saying that they think they're uh, not that good. I think they look a bit like Lego houses. What do you reckon? Anyway, we're heading up Rigby Road now. This is Rigby Road. And uh, just over here, we've got the uh, Blackpool Transport. And uh, if I have a little sneaky look, through this fence here we can see the new building the new shed for the ev buses see that on the left hand side that's all new because they've now got ev buses there you go look at all those buses there wow i hope they've got some good double glazing at these houses because when the cars go over these rumble strips here i'll tell you what it makes a bit of a racket anyway this is the another phase here which uh, they're getting on with now but this section that we're looking at now was left for ages oh my god it was left for ages this section here the original contractor went bust and all this section here was just left for years but now at last they're building on it yeah let's have a little look over the road shall we Blackpool Transport Headquarters there you go oh, we're getting close to the promenade now yeah so these houses now are being built by Tyson I want to show you this here look at that corporation tramways Check it out. Of course, we've got the tram tracks here that go into the tram town over there. The old trams, that is. So that's that way. Just here is where the Coliseum bus station used to be. Just over there, by the on market is. Now, look at this view here. We're looking down. What was Blundell Street? So this was Blundell Street. I think it was Blundell Street. The tram tracks go straight down here. And if we look down here now, we've got... Will it still be called Blundell Street? I don't know. But I know a lot of the streets around here, the new street, the new houses and that, with the, with the little streets, are named after Blackpool Football Club players, I think. So as you can see, there's a bit of work in progress going on down here. Oh, so I'm actually going to head this way down to the road. I've just been spotted by Same fans. So look at that view of the tower down to the road. Check it out. I'm going to head up here and I'm going to turn left and we'll head on to the promenade. So here's a look back down Tilsley Road towards the south and obviously they've knocked down all the houses and hotel with well, the mainly hotels on the left hand side there to build this new housing estate. Uh, no change on the right hand side. And just over here, we've got this purpose-built job centre, which shut down, oh, 2019, I don't know, 2018, it's been empty for ages. You know, when you think of all the homeless people we've got on the streets, and we've got this big, massive building here, empty, completely empty. Oh, it doesn't make sense, does it? Anyway, let's have a look this way, shall we? because we're now looking into this new 
housing estate. How are they getting on? Oh, I tell you what, there's only a few more houses to do, and uh, they're not too far off. French chimpy, chimpy in it, in it there. This is Foxhall as well. Right there the town of the new Philly Sports Park. And we have got another place here. Yeah. It's just open. Bar Kelly's. Check it out. It was the Foxhall. Oldest house in Blackpool. It used to stand right here. Now Bar Kelly's. Check it out. Look at this. Mark Kelly's, pop the from. Here it is, and here you go. It is open. The latest Mark Kelly's right here in Blackpool. Check it out. So, how are we looking, man? I'm just in a different box of old. It's a bit breezy. How are we looking for people? Basically, it is half four on a Sunday, so probably that's the thing. I don't think quite a few people probably will be on the way home now after the weekend, but uh, we can all see very nicely. Let's have a little look out to see, shall we? Check it out. Wouldn't you just love to be here in Blackpool right now? I can see Wales over there. Oh, so clear today. Look at this. Well, there's not that many people on the beach. Well, I'll tell you what, if it's not that busy for people, it's certainly busy for seagulls. Look at all these seagulls. Wow. I'm sure if I uh, like black little seagulls as much as I used to now, as, since I did that fish and chip video in my cupboard and they were all ganging up on me. So, what do you think? Is Blackpool dead? How are we looking? I actually think. It, uh, I mean, yeah, it could be busier, but I, I, after I saw that video I peeped, I thought it was, uh, I thought it looked really dead on there, you know, for the time of year, but uh, it doesn't look too bad to me, actually. So here's a little look at the central pier. Just over here we've got trampolines here. Quite a few more people on the beach on this side. Over there we've got Odyssey. It does seem quite busy around here, you know, but then again it usually does. This is usually the most busiest part of Blackpool Promenade, right here. Happy days. Get into Happy Days. If you want bingo, go there. CJ's bingo. In Happy Days, I need to look at every girl here. I'll just give you a look round. So we're looking west down Chapel Street towards the central pier there where I've just been. Just over there, we've got the sea fish and chips. And just down here is the hog of the one pound burger. But he's shut. He's shut. Yeah, anyway, just over here, I just want to show you something because it's a bit of an update. They're trying to seal off this building over here, the police station, the magistrates' courts. Oh, the bingo's busy. Get in the bingo when you come to Blackpool. Yeah, so as you can see down here, we're walking, this, this section here is a car park. And as you can see, they've put this massive big fence up. They've not finished it off yet, as you can see. If you look down here, they've got holes. They're going to be putting fencing all the way around here to stop the kids getting in because honestly the kids have been running riot 
in this place, yeah. <laughs> now this building over the road is an old church and it's now Blackpool Council housing options. So that's where people go if they need a house in Blackpool, emergency accommodation, whatever. I did a lot, I have no idea how they do it because we've got a shortage of decent quality accommodation and what do they do when they haven't got any? Well I have seen people sleeping outside that place you know there's been tents outside yeah honestly I'm not joking and just over here we've got the neat fancy multi-story Blackpool Central car park check it out I'm now inside the Chapel Street car park look at this yeah all empty all of this is going to be demolished along with the police station the old police station the magistrates courts there's a heck of a lot of concrete here yeah and this place was open as a car park until just about a week ago but as you can see now it's completely empty they've stuck this fence up here the gate's open so i came in i thought i was coming because the gate's open so yeah, all this is going to be demolished later this year. That's going to be something to film, isn't it? Check it out, I've got my drone up in this video. Yes, I'm back with the drone again. Had a few things. I don't know if you can hear those seagulls, but it's kicking off here now with the seagulls. Oh my goodness. You know what? I just tried to fly a drone. I attempted to fly my drone. Oh my God. What a bad idea that was. I thought I'd do a, a little bit of a drone flight because uh, I did one a couple of videos ago and people said, yeah, you should do some more drone flights. But quite honestly, it's impossible because the seagulls, as soon as they see the drone, they, uh, they swoop for it, they dive bomb it, so I thought, you know what, forget it. I just brought the drone straight back down again. So, I wanted to have a little look around here, around the police station. But anyway, you can check out It's Not Your Boy Leroy's video if you want to see some good drone footage. And also, my friend Frank, in, listen to this, they're going mental. My friend Frank in Blackpool shot a complete fly around of the police station just the other day. So I'll put a link to that in the description if you want to have a look at that but that's it for this video i hope you like it how are we looking on a sunday what do you think let me know what you think in the comments uh, i think it was reasonably busy if you like the video hit the like button also hit subscribe and tick the bell for notifications of new videos and i'll see you again on the next one shut up will you Are you living forever?